In Australia, voters have said no to a proposal by the Prime Minister to give First Nations people a voice in Parliament. On Saturday, Australia held a referendum on the initiative, which foresaw the creation of a body dubbed the Voice, whose elected members would be from Indigenous communities, to provide independent advice to the Executive and to Parliament on issues relating to First Nations people. Prime Minister Anthony Albanese regretted the results and said this is not the end of the road and certainly not the end of his administration's efforts to bring people together as he had promised on his electoral campaign. The no got 58.4% of the votes whereas 42% of the people voted yes. Supporters of Australia's Indigenous Rights Referendum react after the vote for the bid to recognize Australia's First Nations peoples failed. But this, this feels pretty, it, it's, it feels pretty awful because I think it just, it's, it's a reflection of who we are as a country, really. But I am very, very disappointed, I'm very sad and I'm tired. Um, so, um, you know, tomorrow will be another day um, and we fight on. An optimist. Regardless of the result, Aboriginal people have been here for 60,000 years and we will continue to be here. And nothing changes for us. And it's just, um, like I said to the gentleman over there, visceral voters will vote no because they fear change.